If you're new to Mahjong, Hong Kong style is the best place to start. It's quite like Remy, where you need four sets and a pair, and your sets can be three in a sequence or three of a kind. The value of your hand depends on the combinations of your sets. There's a link below the video to the lesson playlist if you want to look into that. Otherwise, hang around and watch this game of solitaire. If you're just learning how to play Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and want to improve your game, consider subscribing to my channel. Click the bell so you get notification for when I post new videos, that way you won't miss anything. Let's play some solitaire. I have all my tiles out and they've been mixed. They're all randomly placed back here. We're going to play with a 3 fawn minimum because at Mahjong time, when I play online, they have an eight point table, which is three fawn. So this is really great practice to find score. We're going to say that it is the east wind of the round. I'm going to get 14 tiles for east and then 13 for southwest and north. Okay, everybody has their tiles. Let's see what we can do for East. They have two flowers, a two and a four. Those are not the seat flower for East. East needs a one flower. So they're not gonna get any score for those, but we'll go ahead and get some replacement tiles. Ooh, we got a pair of west. Too bad it's not west round. We'll take it though. That might help get us to a half flush. So let's see what we have for a major suit. We got to get to three fawn, so we've got to get score from somewhere. Either all pung or half flush. And I'm thinking half flush for this player. Because right now they have no score with flowers. So I think a half flush. They have six discards. That's pretty bad. Let's see what South has. Okay. So they have an even number of cracks and dots. We'll have to wait and see what we can do for them. They have no flowers, so that's a, that's a fawn right there. So we need to get two more fawn from somewhere. All chows is one fawn. They do have some dragons. Those might help if we can get a pair and then pung it, because any pung of dragons is a fawn. Let's see what West has. No flowers. There's an east. They have an equal number of bams and dots and cracks. They have an equal number. Maybe we could get them to a all pung, all three of a kind. They have two pair right now. We'll have to wait and see what happens with them. Let's see what north has. Ooh, they have a flower, but it's not theirs. It's a two, two flower, not helpful. South, they have a pair of Souths. That's not their seat uh, wind, but it might help them get to a half flush. Ooh, they have a pair of six cracks and a pair of seven dots. Let's see if we can get them to all pung. If you mix suits with all pung, that's okay, because that's a three fawn hand. Okay, here we go. Let's discard for east. Let's try to get them to a half flush with bams, since that's what they have the most of. Let's throw the seven crack. And then we can draw for south. 
Now south has a 789 already. Let's draw and see if we can get them to either cracks or dots. And then they draw a bam. Not good. Let's start, throw it. Okay, one bam. Nobody can take a one bam. So we'll draw four west. Nine bam. That's a good tile. That's a pair. They have three pair now, right here. One, two, three. So let's discard. Let's keep the nine crack. They're ending up with lots of honors. Let's throw the two crack. And we can draw for north. Four dot. That's not helpful. Let's discard a four dot. And we can draw for east, but this player west can pung that four dot. Let's pung it. West is punging the four dot. So we're going to get them to play a pung hand. They need to pair up. So let's go ahead and discard uh, the nine crack and draw for this player up here. I'm thinking we can have them play all, maybe all pung or cracks with honors. So let's not, although we could chow that here, seven, eight. Let's go ahead and commit. Oh, that's painful. That's all they have though. And they don't, well, they do have a pair of Souths actually. If they have one, two, three sets or potential sets, that's not bad. Let, let's, um, let's chow for north and discard the three bam and then draw for east. Now east has a pair of three bams. Let's pung it. And we'll discard the nine crack and draw for south. Nine dot. Let's discard. Boy, they have a lot of work to do. They're equal. No, no, they have more dots than they do cracks right now. Let's discard the five bam and then draw for player west. They're gonna try for all pung, so let's not do anything with that five bam. That would kill their score. Red Dragon, let's keep it and discard the one dot. And draw for north. Eight bam, nice. Pung, 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 pung. That's, these are all potential pungs. So let's get rid of the east. Nobody can take an east, so let's draw four east. East, and that was just thrown. Let's see here. We're gonna try to get them to half flush with bams. Let's throw the three dot. Nobody can take a three dot, so we'll draw for south. Three dot, keep it. We could maybe pung, pung. Let's discard the seven bam and draw for player west, south. That's not their seat, but we can keep it. Maybe we could, no, they're in mixed suits, so that's not gonna help. But this three dot is not gonna help either. Let's, let's get rid of the honors though, that aren't gonna bring them score. Let's get rid of the south and draw for north. Oh, north can pung, pung. We are punging that south. Okay, we need to discard. Let's get rid of the white dragon. Nobody can take a white dragon, so we'll draw four east. Oh, they got a pung a west. Right there, pung. So they don't need to declare that. If you draw it yourself, you can keep it concealed. So we're gonna try to get them to bam, uh, bams and honors. Let's discard the six dot. And we'll draw four 
play your south for crack. That could help them maybe play all pung because they don't have any exposures yet. So they're not committed to any particular combination. Let's get rid of the one dot because it's already out. Okay, we're going to draw for player west. Nine dot. So we need to pair up in here. Let's see, east has been thrown. Let's discard that. East. And we'll draw for north. Two crack. You know what, let's get rid of this green dragon so we're not stuck with a valuable tile. Green, and then draw for east. One crack, the green was thrown. You know what, we need to get them to a half flush. They can still pair that. Let's throw the one crack and draw for, ooh, west can pung it, pung. So now West has a pung of four dots and a pung of one cracks. Okay, and we're going to discard for West. Let's see here. That red could bring them score. Let's hold it and throw the nine dot for West. And let's have South pung it. So now they're going to commit to all pung. Okay, now we need to choose, let's get rid of the white dragon. And we'll draw four west. Four bam, nice. So there's a good pung, or potential pung I should say. Let's throw the three dot. There's already one out, three dot, and we're going to pung it for south. And let's go ahead and throw the green dragon because there's already one out. And we'll draw for west. Nine crack, discard. Now we'll draw for north. They drew a north. There are none out, but they're set. They already have, uh, oh, they have, they have a, um, a chow of cracks. I messed that up. We need to get them back to a half flush. These are not gonna help them. Otherwise, they'll have no score. I should have kept those honors. Eight bam. I forgot what I was doing for North. Now they're behind the curveball. Okay, eight bam. Or is it behind the eight ball? They got a curveball and they're behind an eight ball. Okay, now we're going to draw four east. I threw an eight bam. Nobody can take it. Eight crack, eight crack. There's one out in a chow, let's throw it. And draw for south. We're trying to have them play pungs, they need more pairs. Three crack, there are no three cracks out. There's a nine crack out, and there's a nine crack out in a an exposure, so let's throw that, nine crack. We could probably throw the seven and the eight too because those are out in, ex in uh, discards. Okay, so nine crack was thrown. So we're gonna draw four west. Five bam, that's a good tile. We need pungs though. Here's a potential and here's a potential. So let's go ahead and discard the five bam. There's already one out. So then we can draw for player north. They got a seven bam. Doesn't matter, we need to get them back to cracks and honors, seven bam. I really messed up their hand. Okay, player east. 
9 bam we can do bams for them so that's a good tile let's throw the seven dot and we're going to draw for south now you think well why not take it for this player they already have a chow of cracks out if you have a chow in a suit you need to if you want any kind of score you got to stay in that suit so we need to get rid of those okay all right so let's see here east through a seven dot so we're going to draw four south three crack oh they needed that pair they need pungs so what's out <clears throat> let's throw the seven crack that's out in both a chow and in a discard pile next we can get rid of that eight crack so seven crack was discarded nobody can take it let's draw for west seven dot that was discarded recently we can throw that and draw for north white dragon huh <laughs> okay there's two white dragons out but that might if they can get a pair that'll help let's throw the eight dot or eight bam that was an eight bam okay now we're down here we can they already have a chow if we take that that would leave them with an eight bam all by itself we might as well draw and see if we can pair up the green dragon or maybe the east there's the green dragon right there throw the eight dot so now let's draw that could be their pair because there's already two green dragons out okay so eight dot was thrown we're going to draw four west two dot two dot two dot let's throw the eight crack that's already been thrown and it's in a in an exposure so let's draw four west seven bam okay that's not going to help them because we need to pung let's discard the seven bam that's for west and we're going to draw for north three crack nice that is badly needed they can chow that let's discard that seven dot and nobody can take a seven dot so we're going to draw for east oops six dot that's a discard nobody can take a six dot we're drawing four south six dot just thrown discard drawing for west two dot that has not been discarded yet for west we're looking for pairs and pungs so none of these are out no red dragons are out let's throw the two dot we're still hoping to pair up that red dragon let's draw for north <gasps> five crack nice get rid of the six or seven dot okay we got some recovery up there so they can pung that maybe and then there's some chow potential in here we still need to get them to pair pair up there so we threw a seven dot let's draw for east five dot that's a discard and we can draw for south nine dot kong so we'll get a replacement tile for the kong one dot they've already discarded it let's go ahead and get rid of it it's already been out and we can draw for south eight dot that's a discard and we'll draw for north flower it's not there so it's a three but that's okay we'll get a replacement anyhow six dot not a keeper okay nobody can take it so we're going to draw for east red dragon okay there's an e there are two east out let's throw that 
and draw four south. Five dot. Nice. They need that. Let's throw the two dot. Okay. Nobody can take a two dot. So we're going to draw for west. They got a west. Okay. Now they have two pungs out. They're going to pung here, pung here. Let's throw the west. Now east has a pung of west, but since we're playing solitaire, there's no benefit to making a Kong. We're just going to not act on that. And we're going to draw four north. Four crack. That's a keeper. There's a chow or two potential. Oh, and there's a chow there. They have some flexibility here. Let's go ahead and get rid of the white dragon. There's already two out. And we'll draw four east now. North. Okay, now they have to get rid of some tiles here. They're one away from, I don't know, I guess they're two away from being ready. They have a ways to go now. There's two green dragons out. Uh, let's go ahead and discard the north and draw four south. Four bam, let's get rid of that north. Let's see, this is, yeah, this is for south. We'll draw four west. Flower, four flower, that's not gonna help them. So we're gonna take a replacement tile. They got a one bam, that's not helpful. Let's go ahead and discard the red dragon. That way it'll block somebody from maybe punging and nobody can take it anyway. Let's draw for north. Two bam, that's a discard for north. And we can draw for east. Two bam. They're in bams, so that's a good keeper. So they're if we discard the red dragon, they're ready on a three bam. Red dragon. And now we're gonna draw for south. Four bam. So now they have all these pairs here that are ready to pung. So let's look and see what's out so we can make the best choice for them. Because they have two pungs already out. And it looks like all of these are fresh. None of these are out. So it really doesn't matter at this point. They have uh, pungs of dots, but we are, we still have probably at least a half a wall left. Although I don't think I would want to clear them to one suit. It's way too risky. There's not time for that. Let's go ahead and discard the five dot because there's already one out in a, dis in a discard pile. So we're going to draw four west. Five dot, that was just discarded. And we're going to draw for north. Oh, eight crack. All right, so they have some potential here. They still need a pair of something. Let's discard the north. We got them back to a half flush, which is nice. So let's draw for east, two dot. That's a discard. Drawing for west, I mean south. Six crack, discard. Or the five dot, that's a safe tile. We're going to draw for west. Five bam. Okay, we need, we need um, pairs here. We need to pung these. They have two pungs already. These can be pungs, so we still need a pair. Let's go ahead and discard the one bam. There's already a pung of three bams out. So a chow is pretty unlikely. So this one, two is not really going to help them. So we can get rid of the two bam next. And we can draw four north. Red dragon, that's been thrown and nobody took it. Let's get rid of it. And we can draw four east. They got an east. Oh, they could have hang, hung on just a little longer. Actually, the east were already all out anyway. Okay, so we're going to draw for uh, south. 
eight dot. That is a good discard. And we're gonna draw four west. Three bam. We need we need pungs in here though. They need to pong. So we're gonna get rid of the two bam or really the three bam. There's already a pung of three bams out. Let's get rid of it. I think that's what I would do, thinking it was safe, and that's Mahjong for East. Mahjong for East, right here. One, two, three, seven, eight, nine. Here's a pung of threes, a pung of West, and a pair of Green. Four sets and a pair, half flush. They do have two flowers here, number two and number four, so those aren't going to bring them score but they have a half flush, which is one suit with winds and dragons. Three fun, that's a winner. Let me know what you think about Hong Kong Mahjong. It's a lot of fun. And even if you have kids at home, it's a great style for them to learn. As young as nine, I think maybe even younger if they can memorize the cracks and the winds and the dragons, which are not that hard because they are color coded, red, white, and green. There's a link below the video to the scorecard with instructions on how to set up and play. And I'll also put a link down there so that you can get your own set. Give it a try and let me know how it goes for you. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, consider subscribing and click the bell so you get notification for when I post new videos. That way you can learn some new strategies or maybe pick up on an insight of the game that might give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for Hong Kong Mahjong, may all your picks be keepers.